at the Saints and the Vikings. New Orleans favored by three. The over-under is 40 and a half. Thoughts on this one? Taking Minnesota at home in a shocker. Um, I shouldn't say soccer. The game split pretty even. The last I looked, 52% of the money was on New Orleans. Um, so it's pretty even down the stretch. I think Minnesota at home, I think the I think these guys are going to rally behind Josh Dobbs. What he did last week, coming in with no practice time, really didn't even know the guys in the huddle. They had to tell him, they had to tell him where to where to position himself in the huddle. Right. right? Like it, it, all the thing and for him to come back and lead them to victory, I think that he gained so much respect and and just kind of a morale boost for this team who uh got off to a shaky start, right? They killed themselves with turnovers at the beginning of the year and it cost them a lot of games early in the season and here they are, they're a game above 500. They have the opportunity to kind of keep, you know, keep pace in the division, at least try and stay within striking distance of the Lions here, but they got to have this one. And then hopefully you get Jefferson back and you can start making a run towards the end here. So uh, I like Minnesota and I actually like the over in this game. I do think we get to 41, 42 points. Fair enough. I'm looking at this one and I really like the Minnesota as well, right? Like not as shocking as, uh, as it, it may seem there, right? Minnesota is four and zero against the spread in their last four. I do think that you're right. That we find enough points to make this thing go to the over, Right, not going to surprise me if we see this one ultimately come down to like a twenty-one to twenty type of deal. Like I think this one's going to play out incredibly, incredibly close. Uh, one of the props that I really like was Joshua Dobbs to go over twenty-eight and a half rushing yards. The uh, Saints have been pretty good against the run all year, but they have been very susceptible to uh, to quarterbacks putting up lots of rushing yards on them and i think that that holds true here as well i'm not going to surprise me if we see josh dobbs you know get somewhere around 40 or even 50 rushing yards in this game fair enough i have josh dobbs over half a touchdown 